it just added a background image it has added some more images for me you can see this is in real time this is absolutely insane like this is like my favorite ai tool now this is like the best ai tool since chat gpt i'm not kidding hello guys welcome back to another video in today's video i'll be going over an insane platform or an insane ai tool that i just came across in the past week now this tool lets you create a complete website from i don't even want to call it prompts like from simple text you don't have to even prompt you just have to tell the platform or um, the text bar what you want and it creates whatever you want in real time and this takes like five seconds let's just get started with the video now the name of this platform is called WebSim ai now when you go on google and you can just search web sim ai and you're going to see um, the first link here the first page that's their um, url and you can just click it and it's going to take you to this um windows kind of looking website now all you have to do from here you don't have to do literally you don't have to do anything you can just log in with your google um account and you can just come here now when you come here you can just you just type exactly what you want the kind of website you want so i'll say now i've asked it the kind of website i want now the next thing i have to do is to tell it um how i want my website to look if the colors I, I want to have on the website and if i want to have header and footer if you're um, a web designer there are stuff that there are um, things that we call headers and the footer the footer is um the things that you see at the base of the website and the header is like the things you see at the top of the website when you just open a web page program for example you see things like home sign up and stuff like that that's on the header so i'm going to just ask it to include the header in the website and then the color or the theme of the website, how I want the website to look. So I just told you to make the website in black and purple as the base colors of the page. So I'm just going to click enter and let's see what it's going to create for me. You can see it's creating this in like real time. This took like how many seconds? It didn't even take up to 10 seconds and it has created the complete web, um, like the completely new website for me. You can see AI optimized, gave me, gave it title, <clears throat> tools, blog, about contacts, unleash your potential with AI, explore AI tools, focus AI, mind map master, have it, have it forge. Now I can ask it now to include more things in the website to make it more robust. Now, how you can do that is by clicking the same place that you actually um, imputed your prompts. You can just go there and just type in what changes you want to see in real, um, on the website. So for example, if I say I want the website to have a sign-in button at the, include um, the website to have a sign-in button at the top here of the page, I'll just ask it to include a sign up sign up um, button at the top of the page and make it purple as well now i've asked it to include the sign up button at the top of the page and then i'll ask it to um, create more content on the web um, on the page as the page looks a little bit scant so you can see in real time it just added a sign up button literally it's that simple and this is like a web you can go over the top with it you can do whatever you want from here you can ask it to add whatever you want you want to ask it for images whatever you can see it just added the sign up button so i'm going to ask it to um add more contents to the page now whatever you do here whatever you type here is being built on the base page so for example i this is the default page that comes with 
um, the platform. So you can just delete this. Now, now I can come here and ask it to add some more contents to the page and probably as well add some images, some um, AI images. We're not doing too much. We're just, I'm just trying to show you how um, capable this platform is. Add some more content to the web site and include images. So it's just going to scrub, and this is using. Um, and Trump picks um, this thing, Sonnet, the latest. That's the language model that this platform runs on. If you go over to <clears throat> their homepage, you can see, like this is the one I created previously, but if I go over to their homepage, you can see, you see the, you can choose from the different um, language models. So if I come here, yeah, you can see I can choose from Anthropic Sonnet, I can choose um, GPT 4.0, 4.0, this latest in um, chat GPT, or I can go over to um, other models. But Sonnet works fine and works amazing, so there's no need to change it. You can just stick to Sonnet. You can see it just added a background image. It has added some more images for me. You can see this is in real time. This is absolutely insane. Like, this is like my favorite AI tool now. This is like the best AI tool since ChatGPT. I'm not kidding. This tool is like really amazing. Now, for you to have this um, page, I'm just going to be open with you. You have to know a little bit, a little bit about um, coding, but you're not going to have to code anything. Now, for you to um, use this web, sites that you've actually created here you can do whatever you want here you can add more things you can take out more things you can build pages so if i want to build the page i'll just come here and rename it i just rename this so this is the home page is ai optimized.tech now that's the home page if i come here and i want to build um, the page for these tools i'll just go ai optimized.tech slash tools now I'm going to create um, another page and it's going to attach that page to the tools page and I'll do the same for the blog and the same for the about and so on and so forth. Now you can <clears throat> export the um, the code for this entire website and plug it into your, your notepad um, plus or whatever um, Visual, Visual Studio or whatever you're using to program regardless of the um, tool you're using to for um, programming and you can just copy and paste and it's going to um it's going to replicate this exact website that you that you have here over on that page so this is like a really really amazing tool for web developers or if you don't know much about when web development and you need a website you can just go and play with this tool and do a little bit of research and you have an insane website in a matter of like minutes. It took me like how many minutes to just create this website. It is really amazing. And this is like the, the worst we can ever um, have when it comes to artificial intelligence right now. So just go over to websim.ai and you can start playing with this tool. And the tool is free by the way. I don't know how um, long this tool is going to be free because this tool is like really amazing. I don't know how long it will be free, but you can just go over to their websites now and you can play with this tool. And I hope you found this tutorial useful. I like. I hope you like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.